Hi there! In this video, I'll be showing you how to create a simple bar graph in Microsoft Excel. If you're not familiar with a bar graph, it's simply a graph with categories on the horizontal or x-axis and values on the vertical or y-axis. A bar is then drawn for each category to represent the value that is related to each category. Bar graphs can also be drawn with the categories on the y-axis and values on the x-axis, but this will be covered in a later video. For now, we will be focusing on the standard vertical type of bar graph that you see here. Now to create a bar graph in Microsoft Excel, you need two things. You need your list of categories, and you need a list of values that relate to each category. Once you have these two main pieces of information, you are ready to create your bar graph. To create the bar graph, start by selecting all of the cells that contain the data. With the cells selected, go to the Insert tab in the Excel ribbon, and click on the bar or column charts button under the charts group. Select the first option you see under the 2D column category and this will create your bar graph. Now with the graph created, you can change the chart title to something meaningful by selecting the chart and then selecting the title to change it. Click away from the graph when you're done typing and if you click on the graph again, you should see a small square with a plus icon appear next to the chart. You can click on this icon to adjust many of the features of the chart. One such thing you can do is turning off the grid lines. Finally, if you want to adjust the size of the y-axis labels, simply click on the y-axis and use the ribbon to adjust the font size to something more readable. You can do the same thing with the labels for the x-axis as well. Now there is one thing I want to point out when it comes to creating a bar graph in Excel. If I navigate over to my second sheet, you will see that my category values are numbers this time instead of text. If I try to make the bar graph the same way I did before, Excel becomes confused and doesn't realize that the numbers 5 through 8 are actually categories instead of values. To fix this, I'm going to start by deleting the chart and trying again. This time, I'm only going to select the values to start with. I will then create the chart, just as I did before. Once I have the chart created, I will right click on the chart and click on Select Data. The Select Data Source dialog box will then open up. Under where it says Horizontal or Category Axis Labels, I will click on the Edit button. I'll select the numbers in my category column this time and then hit OK. I'll click on OK one more time and you can see that the numbers have now been properly applied as categories instead of an extra set of values. And that's how you create a simple bar graph in Microsoft Excel. Thank you so much for watching. Be sure to comment down below if you have any questions and don't forget to subscribe. You can also visit us at SpreadsheetLife.com for more useful content and over 100 templates that you can download for free. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you in the next Spreadsheet Life video.